all right so what is good everybody on youtube this is of course your boy b bullet rc coming at you guys again with yay yeah, another video and y'all already know what time it is man y'all see the boxes one two three four five six seven eight eight boxes of brand new pickups two very very needed delayed w's for retail and y'all sure already know what that means man it's time for another edition of unboxing a ton of dope ish dope shit whatever way you want to say it um i'm gonna just start with these two on the top really quick just because um they were just quick delay w's you guys probably already know what's in this box i was able to secure both of these shops out to the homies in the correct size and i went ahead and let go of uh, both size 11s on uh, Bulls Bodega. And shouts out to anybody that's been copping stuff off the Bodega. The link is always down below. I'll be shipping off everything in the next one to two days. It's a lot of stuff, and I'm going to be adding some more stuff to the site too. But infrared Air Jordan 6s, size 12, brand new DS for retail, which was 200, which was one thing I didn't even touch on on the review because you guys know the black metallic fives were 220. Um, and it was the same thing with the Nike Air. So I'm glad that they brought the price back down with the Nike Air kicks. And of course, one of my very favorite sneakers of this year, these right here in a size 12, the Turbo Green Air Jordan 1s. Y'all know how much I like this shoe right here. And I was able to actually grab these in a size 12 in my true size and for that retail. So shouts out to the homies for the oops. Now, so let's just go ahead and crack into this one first, uh, just because I, I cut it open because I didn't know which box was which. And um, this one, I think they just sent to me as a gift. They said I didn't have to show it off if I didn't want to or whatever. It's not like an ad or anything, but they sent me over this pair of Cell Venoms. Now, this colorway in particular, I'm not the biggest fan of. It's kind of like a, I mean, when I seen it, I thought uh, like a watermelon color, and I do have another pair of Cell Venoms in here that I actually like a lot more than this pair. But it was a gift, so I just wanted to say thank you for this pair right here, this colorway. I've actually never seen this colorway before, but it does say Puma White Fuchsia Purple. Now, let's get into, uh, we'll just clear off these and we'll get to this side. So, this one right here actually came from overseas. It came from in clothing and um, the homie actually let me know of a shoe that I was looking for. It had sold out and he hit me up and was like, yo, they're available here. If you want to go ahead and grab a pair, you can get them. So I appreciate him and he knows exactly who he is. He had hit me on thing like Instagram DM uh, and let me know. But this one is from end clothing. Bam. Y'all see the big end on the front. Y'all know I order stuff from End all the time. And I will say, even though they are an overseas, like, boutique, overseas retailer, um, their shipping is on point, bro. Two to three days from overseas, like, can't really beat it. So, if we go ahead and break into this box, I'll put it right here for right now. There are two pickups, a little envelope with the receipt, but we have the end paper. Very nice. They do kind of separately wrap the stuff that they have. Now this was the Puma and Adder Error crew neck and I got this one in a size XL. This was actually the color I was looking for, um, but they didn't have it on Puma.com, so I found it somewhere else. It definitely looks like it fits a little big, definitely oversized. I'm pretty sure I can still fit it though. It is all over green and this was from the Puma and Adder Error um, collab. And I just really was digging like this pine green crew neck. Definitely is oversized. Uh, I probably could have gotten this in a large. So if you're looking at any of this stuff, um, you probably can size down. This is a, a smooth, probably 2X pretty easily. But the main course out of this box is this right here and um like i said they sold out on puma.com but i was able to grab a pair on end once again faster than youth and this is another pair from the adder error collab and this was the rsx intervention all the paper all the paper this might be one of the cleanest colorways in this silhouette. My lights might be blasting them out just a little bit, so I guess I'll throw up a little B-roll right here just so you guys can see some of the details. The cream on the midsole, you got this silver around the upper, you got more of that cream color towards the toe box. Suede's a really hairy suede on the, well, it doesn't even feel like suede, just something super soft on the side. Nice leather, they changed up the way the pull tabs work on the back, it's actually all over metal, and I just overall like this colorway. and. The 
the Puma logos and the Adder logos uh, where they throw them at. Either way though, I'm just glad I was able to get these straight up for retail. Shouts out to the homie um, for helping me out with these. I really wanted this pair and um, I really like this collab. So I went ahead and grabbed, well, You'll see the next pair very soon. Now this box right here actually comes from the homies over at Soul Play in Atlanta. I always appreciate them. And they um, actually sent me over something and Anna something over. So as always, bruh, y'all know when I get back down there, get back down to the A, I will, I will, of course, pull up on y'all. And they just sent us over two of their Soul Play hoodies. And you guys can see both hoodies right here. One is a gray large for Anna and one is a blue XL for me. Soul play right there, embroidered and stitched in on the top. And um, as always, bro, appreciate y'all sending something over. And then there were three. Now, Nike, Puma, Nike. And I'm not exactly sure which order this Nike stuff is in. Let me take my address off and put it on the back of the box so you can't see it. But another Nike box right here. And um, both of these shoes, well, one of them is super weird. One of the other ones I'm most likely gonna be throwing up on a bodega for retail rather than sending them back to Nike. I don't even know if they're still available on Nike, they might be, but instead of just sending them back to Nike, I'd rather just throw them up on bodega for uh, retail plus shipping if someone else can cop. And uh, yeah, it's these, it's these. And I told y'all already that I should have never bought this sneaker. Sometimes when you're on Nike sneakers, you might enter on a shoe just because you know you're about to take an L on another shoe and uh, hopefully get that delayed W on it. But Nike for 175, the Defiant Couture Air Jordan 1s. So yeah, yeah. Nike, enjoy my 175 to 180 just because I was not faithful in the system. So I just tried it on another shoe. Thinking that I wouldn't get the shoe. So yeah, the Defiant Couture Air Jordan 1 all over black with the red um, racing stripe. Also calling back to all the other BS that they're trying to do with the storytelling with this shoe. Uh, the leather is, it's shiny, it's shiny, it's uh, it's cool, I guess. I definitely see how some people might really, really dig this Air Jordan 1, um, but for me personally, uh, I'm just not a big fan, bruh, and, and like I said, I really, really shouldn't have even entered for the sneaker, but I will be tossing these up on the bodega, so if anyone needs them, if anyone wants them, they are a size 12. Yeah, size 12 for retail for you, Blam Bulls Bodega. Link will be down below. Yeah, yeah, man, they, they got me on that one, bruh, and I was, shouldn't have bought those, man. Should not have bought these. Next up out of the boxes, we have this right here and this was another big box that i copped directly off of puma y'all probably have already guessed exactly what this guy is in here and i don't know why they send over this huge big box for one pair of shoes like i said i know i'm yacht gang but sheesh this is a big ass box but on the inside why are these shoes so heavy bruh we have another box puma and adder error and i copped the cell venom uh colorway and i think the first time i seen these i seen upscale vandal wearing them and i just was like yo what is that colorway because out of all the cell venoms that was the best colorway that i've seen and here they are right here now these are going to look big they're going to look very very torpedo like yacht game like submarine like and that's because i got these in a size 13. the reason i got these in a 13 is because i feel like these joints fit small like they fit snug just like the rsx and there was no 12 and a half i just knew when that 12 most likely my toes are going to be screaming and um it's either i'm going with the 12 and taking the insole out or i'm going with the 13 and having them look a little longer than they need to be i just went with the 13 on these but once again puma and adder air this is the cell venom i really like the color blocking on these and even down some materials on these joints were super super dope definitely one of the best puma collabs this year in my opinion i mean we're only in march so we have the whole rest of the year to get into these but that was puma and adder era that was a cell venom and i got mine in the size 13 once again cell venom rsx in my opinion they do fit a little bit snug so go up a half a size if you can and last up to go ahead and end this video off i have this box right here once again coming 
straight from Nike. I actually bought these around All-Star time. It was one of those where you had to have a sneakers camera and you had to have like a notebook in the picture to order the sneaker. And this was the shoe that I was talking about and I wanted to try out for myself. We've been talking about this shoe for a very, very long time on the channel and I finally was able to get this pair in and I'll most likely be doing a review. Um, I don't know if I love, hate, I don't know, but this is this is definitely one of those weirder shoes and man, the box pile is getting kind of crazy over here. But y'all see the box all over black with Jumpman right here, 00023, designed for flight. It's a very different, interesting looking Jordan box. And this is the Jordan Apex Utility and retail price on this one is 200. Uh, Y'all know, we've been talking about these, like I said, for a while. And this was the black, clear, and, and red colorway. So it's these right here. Now, first impressions, as I've seen them, this is definitely that weird shit. <laughs> like, this is definitely that weird shit. But I thought I would be very strongly either hating or loving this sneaker when I first saw it. And uh, I mean, I don't want to like it kind of because they're kind of out there, but they're ugly, but I, I kind of I kind of fuck with them in person, if, if I'm being completely honest. The overall look of them is not bad. I guess the biggest thing is just that clear aspect all over the upper that might not be something that people really dig. I just know these are gonna be super comfortable, and it's like a double layer sneaker. You have an Air Jordan 1 fly knit bread underneath of this, and um, out of all the colorways, this is just definitely one of the better colorways. I definitely dig how the inside is as well, so, probably be expecting a full review on these sometime this week this this is an interesting interesting shoe but listen man that is it much love to all the fam followers and of course supporters you guys can follow me on instagram twitter soundcloud snapchat the snapchat is bull.cb by the way here there blah blah of course i mean i got these weird shits right here so bullet rc and i'ma see y'all on the next video y'all let me know what shoes did y'all pick up last week or did you just save all your guap for something else that's coming out a little bit later and uh what do you think about these one word to describe these joints right here anyways i'ma see y'all on the next video um like i said should be one more video in a row i think we're we're at three in a row so y'all be easy i hope y'all enjoy drop a like on this bit too peace I'm hot like a stove. My jewelry so cold, she play with her nose. Look at my clothes. Look at my bitch, she got the white toes. She wanna look lavish. I took her to Paris, but I can't do marriage. My shooters, they savage. My shooters, they shooting, they pushing with caskets. I went to Coachella. Uh, I met a white bitch, me and her.